Well, this morning, an Adams County neighborhood is taped off and is now a crime scene after deputies shot a suspect. This happened overnight. And Denver 7's Eric Louver is live off of Osage near Pecos and Highway 36. So, Eric, how did this all start? Well, it started with a phone call a block over and deputies showed up there, but it led us to Osage here, which is just east of Pecos. So it started around 8 o'clock last night when deputies got that call. Someone said that a man had shown some sort of weapon. So deputies arrived at that address off of Navajo, again, about a block away, but they couldn't find anyone. They didn't know what was going on there, but they were told where the suspect was going, which was a block over to a home here on Osage. So when deputies showed up, that's when the suspect fired at one of the deputies. That deputy fired back, hitting the suspect, and that man was taken to the hospital with unknown injuries. New for you this hour, we are being told and we are seeing that neighbors are being allowed in and out of the crime scene here so they can go to work and to school, but they still have it blocked off to the media and everyone else. So you can see the crime tape. You can see two squad cars on either end of the scene. And also we're gonna zoom in now on the porch light. Uh, we believe this is the home that was involved here. When will this crime scene clean up? We don't know. Perhaps investigators will come again when the sun comes up. We saw a crime scene van come and go. That crime scene van left about an hour ago. So we'll wait and see what happens here. And we'll try to get word on the condition of this suspect. The deputy who fired his gun is on administrative leave. I'm Eric Lufer, Denver 7.